In the previous demo, I showed how to create a report builder report based on parts already created. Now I'm going to show you how to create one possible part. I'm going to create a gauge. To start off, I just go to the insert tab and choose the gauge option. This gives me this wizard with a range of gauge types. I'll choose this linear scale with pointer and then click OK. Now I've got to choose the data. I haven't got any data sources set up in this report, so I'll click New. Here I need to set the details for my connection. I'll connect to the Contoso Retail database. If you're good with SQL, you can write the query directly, or you can use the Query Designer option. Here I'll do something simple. I'll just bring in the sales quantity and unit price fields. I have a range of other fields and filters that I could use if I wanted. This associates those two fields with this part, but I need to set how it will display them. When I select the item, I see this gauge panel. I see that the linear pointer is displaying data, but it's unspecified as to what it's showing. So I'll specify sales quantity. I could write an expression to combine multiple fields. By right-clicking, I can go to the pointer properties. Here there are a whole range of things I can set based on the values in my database. The value of the pointer is already set to the sum of the sales quantity. But I can change other things. I'll set that the width of the pointer should be a function. I'll set the width to be the average of my unit price divided by 10. So now I have a gauge that displays two pieces of information in a visual way.